Hello everyone, today we're going to be playing some Kerbal Space Program uh, with the release of, what's it called? Kerbal Space Program 2 coming out uh, February 25th, which is a month away. Um, I thought why not give this, game, give, give this game a try and we're also going to be playing another space game, you might know it, Universe Sandbox 2. We recorded it in the early days of the channel uh, back in 2021, so we're going to um, play it again. I'm gonna try and try and uh, get it tomorrow, hopefully, and try and record it tomorrow. If not, then probably the day after, probably the 27th or 26th. So let's hop into this game. Full screen it. Uh, let's hop into NASA 3. I did a test run just then, and I realized that there were that the screen was all black and it was only me and this webcam in this corner so I needed to re-record it uh, and this is the second second recording so first off we're gonna have a Mark 3 cockpit let's see if I can turn it around yes let's get that up there all right so first off we'll need well actually first off we'll need a heat shield on both sides we'll need mark 25 parrot oh gosh that hurt my face oh i got itchy nose today uh mark 25 parachute put that there and we'll also have a couple of these mark 12 no, we won't go with the Mark 12s. Where are the other ones? These ones. Mark, wait, what did I say? Mark 2. We'll go with the Mark 12s then. Let's just dot them out. Let me just put on like 6 symmetry or something. Yeah, okay. That'll do. That'll do. <laughs> That looks weird. Alright, now we'll have a decoupler, or a coupler, whatever you call it. Um, then we'll have a, I like to use the Kerbidine S37200 tank, and for my final tank I like to use the Kerbidine S314400 tank. So, we're gonna go with these, this, sorry. Um, engines. I like to go with two rhinos for the first couple stages, and then for the final stage we have um this this the S3 KS25 25 by 4 Mammoth liquid fuel engine. So yeah. Um, next thing we'll need a coupler, and then we'll need. Two and two two fuel tanks and another ri rhino. Is that a rhino? That's not a rhino. This is a rhino. All right, and then we'll have a coupler. We'll have three of these. Like I said. one of these and then we'll have this here we go why not for extra propellant we'll add extra extra fuel tanks so we'll have two x symmetry on put those there we'll have some nose cones <coughs> big enough and as well we'll have these on the bottom <laughs> I'm joking we'll have the rhinos there. just for extra propellant all right so the first coupler where is the first coupler the first couple is there so I think we'll be all right with that all right let's uh, get our crew so we've got Jebediah uh, we'll swap out Jebediah all right and we'll put in here all right let's go to launch what? Don't tell me the game crashed. Right. Don't. Okay, good. Okay, got it. 
don't worry. Alright, uh, let's turn on SAS, stability, uh, turn the throttle up to 100, and let's go. And, this. and we're off. engine to come back down and then we're gonna have a space plane hopefully <laughs> i'm gonna try and make one all right we've reached outer space let's turn off the engine let's get to a hundred thousand kilometers and turn back down all right now we're going to throttle turn back down oh gosh this is, this is not, not going too well. Let's go retrograde, here we go. And that'll bring us right back down, hopefully into the ocean. And we're trying to, I'm trying to do my best with the thrust to get us back down, but the space is sliding us up. It's gravity is trying to pull us back down, but it's not working because the escape velocity of us earlier. But as you can see, our orbital uh, mass is set, uh, m meter second is slowing, so we should come back down at around probably 170,000 kilom uh, kilometers, 170 kilometers. That's my estimate, but I don't know. Try my best to come back now. And uh, this, this, this heat shield—that's why I put it there because it will help us thrust, kind of push us back down. And we're actually about to run out of the thrust. And the gravity will pull us back down in a second. And there we go. A little bit under my estimate. But that's okay. Estimates are never correct. Nope. Retrograde it. Retrograde it. Hurry, hurry, hurry. Come on, come on. Yes, we're slow. We're going. Don't. Don't. Yes. Yes. Okay. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. No! Oh, we're out of... Right, hopefully gravity will try and pull us back down. Let's just wait for gravity to take it. Yes, okay, we're going back down. Let's let gravity do its job. Let's speed this up. Alright. 
destroy this and let's help come back down. Alright, and arm everything. Hopefully we don't get smashed into one of these flying debris. Alright, looks like we're gonna land in a map in this area again, just like the test. Oh, this is why I put heat shields on. Uh-oh. <laughs> Doesn't, doesn't look good. Well, I wish you could have landed in the ocean, but. Eh. Alright, and the air is starting to be strong. Come on, where are the rest? Where are the rest of the shoes? Yes, holy! <laughs> That's gonna slow us down a lot. Especially near a mountainous area, it's good. <laughs> Shit, that's gonna take a long time to get down, so I'm gonna speed it up. This is four times speed and warp time, and it's so slow. Look, this is in real time. So, yeah, it's going very, very slow. Slow down to three, two, one, time, speed, and are we safe? We're safe. All right, bit of a hard landing, but we made it. And yeah, everyone looks fine. So let's cover this. Oh gosh, whoopsie. Uh, what am I? Uh, uh, what button? There we go. Alright. Oh gosh. Press the wrong button. Alright. I think that's going to end it today for this game. Remember, tomorrow or the day after, we are going to be recording a Universe Sandbox video. Brand new. Ev like, we haven't played it since the early stages of the channel so i hope you guys will enjoy it i'll see you next time subscribe and like because it helps out the youtube <laughs> bye that's really